Kenya's Central Bank placed Imperial Bank Limited, which completed a bond sale earlier this month, under statutory management because of what it termed as unsafe and unsound business practices. This afternoon, Bank of Uganda issued a statement on Imperial Bank's operations in the country, which it says will remain open for smooth business operations. The beleaguered financial institution has now been placed under the direct management of the Central Bank, declared the governor. We would like to inform the customers and the general public that Imperial Bank is very limited, will remain open and its operations will continue normally as has been the case. The only difference is that it will be that its operations will be under the control of the Bank of Uganda. Founded in 1992, Imperial Bank has outlets in Kenya and Uganda, where it has been operational for three years with the Mukwana Group as part of its strategic local shareholders. Over the years, the Ugandan regulator has closed all suspended operations of banks in similar circumstances, including Global Trust Bank, Trans Africa Bank, International Credit, Teife Trust Bank, Cooperative Bank, Greenland Bank and National Bank of Commerce. According to a statement from the Capital Markets Authority in Kenya, Imperial announced on October 2nd it had sold close to 72 billion Ugandan shillings of 15% bonds due in December 2020. These securities were scheduled to begin trading on the Nairobi Securities Exchange earlier today. The listing has been cancelled. Malcolm Sime, NTV Tonight.